The religious youth service last week commenced a week-long project to refurbish certain parts of the ancillary community. The religious youth service is a subgroup and funded by the Universal Peace Federation. The youth program is meant to unite young people of different religions under the theme Young People Working Together for Peace. The program was founded by Dr. Sun Young Moon and has visited over 50 countries. Remy Topia, Secretary General of the Universal Peace Federation, has been a resident of St. Lucia for the past 13 years and suggested ancillary be the visited community. So the Universal Peace Federation has one of these activities in this religious youth service. The goal of this religious service uh, is to give an experience to young people that no matter which faith they are from, somehow every young people is seeking for a better world, working to work together. The youth service group undertook many projects, including painting the infant school and the public washrooms, putting together productions for the community with the ancillary youth, and refurbishing the houses of some citizens. Mario Glasgow, Worksite Project Coordinator, says the residents of the small community showed much appreciation by assisting the projects. It gives me great joy when I'm doing these kind of projects and the people from the community come out to help you. So with that, it's sort of like we're encouraging them to do more for their community while they're encouraging us to help them. So it's nice to have them with us. So I think the motivation that they've give, given us so far is, is really great and we're very thankful for the help. Humilita Modest, president of the Ancillary Club 60 group, says the residents whose houses were refurbished were deserving of the treat. She says residents long complained of the condition of their houses but were unable to do repairs on their own. Modest spoke on behalf of the residents and expressed much joy for their efforts. I'm very grateful for the offer because we have done quite a bit because some of the houses, they were really, if you touch your hand, have to go, was going through it and we have thing is and we have fixed it on the help of the religious group. 14 St. Lucian youth from around the island joined the youth group in their project. The group will be done by Monday afternoon and in August will be in Haiti assisting earthquake ravaged victims. They will stay there for 10 days and visit some more islands at the end of 4th. Sant Justin, HGS News, Channel 4.